morning. Right now we are walking through the town of Lillehammer, which was home to the 94 Winter Olympic Games here in Norway. Um, there's nothing really open <laughs> right now, so it's kind of want to show you something, but it's not really open. We're just gonna like wander. I'm so excited. Right now we're getting ready to do some bobsledding. And as you can see, I am on Team Sweden. We all have bobsled teams. And ours is obviously the best, so go Sweden. We got a flag. It's pretty rocking. <laughs> Looking good, girls. Obviously, Sweden is the best dress here. Yeah, go Sweden. There's also some other people. There's Australia and. Well, so Germany, Poland, and it's gonna be a race. Let's see who wins. I don't know what score we're gonna get. <laughs> Interesting. All right, so I'd like to welcome you to Lillehammer Olympics for the loose track. This is where they held the Olympics in '94. So you'll be going down the exact track. Uh, this is Daniel and this is Thea. They're gonna be your pilots for today. That means they're gonna be steering, uh, and I'll be in transportation. That means I'm gonna go in the car. Yes. But first, I have to say that it's very important that you don't have or have had any back problems, neck problems, heart or lung diseases, or if you're pregnant. If you are any one of these things, this is not suitable for you. That is because of the fact that you will experience three G-forces, which is equivalent of three times your own body weight, which is going to push you down. So if you have a back problem, it might, you know, it could go wrong. Not quite the same as if it were snow, but... It's still pretty awesome. I can't hear what I'm saying. Can you hear it? I can't hear myself. Yours isn't as low. Yours isn't as low. Mine's like really low. Yeah, it isn't as low. What do you mean? Like, you yeah, think it's as low? Time? Like you could see your face. <laughs> Is it really pretty face? Yeah. It's amazing. It's gorgeous. <laughs> Grazes on there. My leg got instant bruise. Oh, my neck. My leg oh. was squished up. Oh. Like, oh. Instant bruise. Oh, what? Whoa. That's from my leg getting slammed. My legs didn't hit anything. It was just my head. My head was like. Oh. That was amazing. I'm gonna hide in my flag. Oh, oh my flag. <laughs> Pretty sure we're losing. Team Sweden is not winning this race. <laughs> Alright. We are currently driving through the Lily Joe Tunnel. It's the longest tunnel in the world. 24, 28 kilometers. Or is it 28 kilometers? Something like that. It's a really long tunnel. Odds of touching snow for the first time. <laughs> Norway, you are impressing me right now, and I am enjoying it. So, Norway, they're very big on folklore here. Mainly everything to do with trolls. Um, they believe that trolls live in land, and every time you see a rock formation like that one right there, is actually a troll that has been, well, I guess, stunned, crystallized by the sunlight because they 
you know, they're allergic to sunlight. So when they step into it, they get turned into stone. It's kind of cool, because there's tons and tons tons of these little, like, rock formations that are supposedly trolls here. So right now we are making our way down to the Guy Fenier Fjord. I think I'm saying that right. We're right down there, and we're going to take a little ferry ride over. In the fjord. <laughs> I like saying that. Fjord. <laughs> 